Hey, what's up everybody? It's Sam here with your daily businesses video. And in this video, sorry, I'm just scrolling here to get my notes uh, so I don't get messed up here. But in today's video, I wanted to talk to you about uh, Instagram and how you should use it for your business. You know, Instagram is huge. Um, and there's a few things that we're going to talk about in this particular video just to make sure. And that's why I've got my notes here. I don't want to, I want to make sure I hit the four key points that I actually wanted to talk about. Right, so why should you actually use Instagram for business? First and foremost, it's 60, it's 80% more engaging than Facebook, right? Which means at a very basic level, if you want, if you get one, if you get 10 likes on your average Facebook post on, on Instagram using the right strategy, you'll get 80, right? So you can see that's eight times more powerful. When it comes to uh, Twitter, as it compares with Twitter, it's 63% more engaging. So what that actually means, what does engaging mean? Engaging means that you're going to get more followers, right? More likes, more comments, which essentially leads to more prospects and then potential customers, right? So am I saying that Instagram is better than Facebook? No, not necessarily. But what I am saying is that it is a powerful, powerful tool that you can use to get hundreds, if not thousands of clicks eventually to your website every single day, 100% free, right? And there are absolute, absolute ways of how you go about doing that. And I'm going to teach you that a little bit later on. So what you want to do with Instagram, obviously, the, the, the most obvious thing is you want to download uh, the, the app itself. So you want to get the app on your phone, or if you've got like a computer, you want to download the app from the store, you know, whether it's Windows Store or iPhone Store so that you can set up on your desktop. Now, the desktop is a little bit more complicated because it's the, the app itself is designed very much to be about the smartphone, right? So you want to get that and set up your account. Now, there are a couple of tips that I want to give you quickly here in regards to setting up your account. Now, if you're building your own personal brand, then yes, your name is a good idea. But I'm also going to tell you that if you're going to build like uh, something that's a little bit more catchy, something that you want to be using something along the lines of like your uh, like your blog name, if you've got a unique blog title, right? Uh, for example, my, my blog title was just my name. So I decided not to go with my name in, in building my Instagram account. Um, but instead, I did your online business coach. Now, so for anybody out there, look me up on face uh, on Instagram, your online business coach, uh, because I'm going to start be, I'm going to start doing some great things on Instagram that you probably miss a lot out on Facebook due to the uh, engagement thing that I spoke about a little bit earlier on. So, what to do with Instagram? With Instagram, you want to be very careful with what it is that you actually do because there are things that penalize you and things that don't penalize you. So. What you want to do, for example, is you want to set up a bio immediately, yeah? You want to follow a few accounts that are related to your niche, and then you want to set up your URL in your bio link, and because you can't, uh, you can't put your URL, right, in the actual post, but you can refer people back to your bio where they'll click, and absolutely, you will get clicks. There's no doubt about it, so make sure you put your URL in there. And then the fourth and final thing is you want to make sure you put in a description of 150 characters or less. Yes, you want to do that because in doing so, it's going to tell people exactly who you are and what it is that you're about, right? So you want to put like, from a, for example, myself as a coach, I kind of put out there that I'm here to help people grow their business and to help grow themselves as individuals. That tells people exactly what my account is going to be about. Motivation, inspiration, business tips, uh, live video, live training videos and so on and so forth, just like I do here on Facebook, right? So a couple of things that you do not do not want to do is use the follow unfollow methods that most people out there are doing, right? Honestly, it's a terrible idea. It's going to destroy your account. What most people do is they use some sort of a bot or a software and it follows people based on who they've liked or who they're sorry, who they're following and or it's a uh, or what they do, and then what they do, sorry, is that they unfollow them after a certain amount of days if they don't follow back, right? Or they follow them based on a, a like a certain hashtag keyword that they've used in their description, right? And what actually happens is Instagram actually penalizes you for doing that, right? So it's a terrible idea to actually do. What you really want to do is find um, organic ways of going about building your traffic that's going to really bring you people that really actually matter, right? You don't you don't necessarily just want followers, unfollowers, because you know they're, they're, they're using software, they're not necessarily on their phone doing the thing, you know, and they're not really the kind of customers that you want. I mean, let them do whatever they want, okay? But you don't want your account to be suspended or deleted or banned. Now, I don't think that will ever actually happen, happen to be the case, but you do, in fact, get penalized from Instagram from following such strategies, okay? So go ahead and give me a thumbs up if you're not going to follow that strategy, because I'm urging you right now, please, please, please don't do that shit okay it's going to ruin your account so uh 
a few things here, right? So I wanted to keep this training stupid simple, really, really basic on why to actually use it. And I hope I've actually convinced you why you need to do it. Again, 80% more engaging than Facebook, 63% more engaging than Twitter, all right? And so what I want you to do is I'm going to put together a free subscribers only training teaching exactly how to get 10 times more likes on your very first lot of uh, posts compared to Facebook, okay? So look, everybody who knows me knows that I've been building up Facebook for some time now, all right? And so even with, with what it is that I do, I mean, there are, there are still a ton of people um, that, that like and, not, and don't like what it is that I do, and that's fine, okay? But I'm just gonna give you a little example here, okay? That's why I'm looking at my phone. So you guys, I hope you guys can see this post here. Let's see if I can get this up here. And I hope you can see at the bottom there. You see, there's basically like six likes, right? And, and zero comments. So that's that's your typical Facebook for you, right? And then I'm, now I'm gonna go on to Instagram and we're gonna have a look. And in case you guys can't see this, exact same post, liked by 47 people and there are seven comments, right? So automatically, you know, there's 47 likes versus my Facebook, which I've been building up for a long time that only had seven likes, right? That's seven times more likes, right? That's that's uh, seven times more uh, comments as well than I've got on Facebook. Now, you don't think any of those likes or any of those comments are gonna turn into followers, and then you don't think any of those followers aren't gonna turn into subscribers, right? And then those subscribers into customers. This is how it goes. This is the acquisition of uh, follower to prospect to customer, right? This is the process, guys. I'm literally giving it to you on a silver platter. Now, I'm gonna show you in this members only, in this subscribers only training, so all you need to do is subscribe to my email address. I'll put a link in the description below that you can actually go to. Sign up to that, I'll be, I'll be emailing out the training in the next 24 hours for my subscribers only. Exactly how to do what I've just shown you. Now, I just told you guys literally, I am a businessman, right? So I'm, a, I'm more about motivation and inspiration and giving you business tips. Yet that post, this post, right, was actually about, what? Well, what was it about? Working out, right? And I got 47 likes and seven comments, right? So that shows you the power because I wasn't even focused on that. I didn't even really channel that to get those likes and those comments, but there are specific strategies you can follow to get you those kinds of results. And I'm gonna give them to you in my, uh, in my training that I put together for my subscribers only. Okay, so look, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope I convinced you that, you know, joining uh, Instagram and building your business through that way, the main reasons are two. One, it's 80% more engaging than Facebook, right? Two, it's 63% uh, more engaging than Twitter. Those are the only reasons you really need to know. Ultimately, it comes down to numbers. Certain amount of people see your offer, certain amount of people that see your offer become customers. The more customers, the more money, okay? Now, I hate to break it down that simple, but that's really what it is. So go ahead and, and comment on this section that saying that you do actually want the training. I will put a link in the description that you can go to and sign up immediately. And then once, once that training is put together, which I will be doing tomorrow because I'm just about to go and watch the State of Origin game, yeah, so go Queenslanders. And then I will put the training together tomorrow and get that out to every single person on my email list, all right? So take care, much love. I'll see you all again tomorrow.